Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy Connie back at you today with another quick video. Now listen, today we just got great news. Anybody out there that has not completed their rookie premiere players, maybe you need one more. Maybe you need two or three. However many you need, I have some great news for you. It's going to help you out significantly. Um, EA Cralo, the community manager at EA for Madden, he just tweeted that they will be resetting the rookie premiere packs in the store tomorrow. So, as you, as you guys all know, there's 20 packs that you're able to get in here that it's, it's only a limit of 20. So, I already did mine on not just this account. I did it on five other accounts that I have because that was the only other way I was going to be able to finish all the rookie premieres within a couple of days. So, I already did this five times on each account. So, if you guys have not bought all of your packs, make sure you buy your packs now. Because tomorrow morning, I believe tomorrow morning, Saturday morning, usually it's probably around 10.30 a.m. Uh, Eastern Standard Time. So, if you're on the East Coast, you, 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 you're going to have until about 10.30 to, to buy the packs that you have already. It's 25k each times 20. That's 500k, I believe. Yeah, that's 500k. So get all those packs. That's gonna get you one rookie premiere for 500k. So if you have not done so, make sure you do that today. Make sure you do it today. Tomorrow morning they will reset at I believe 10:30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, which is 7:30 on the West Coast. So that's great news. I myself, I have actually already completed all of the rookie premieres on my account. So I actually have all my guys in my lineup right now. They're all NATs. Uh, I have a few guys that are power up still in my lineup that I won't get much coin for, so I just kept them in there. I'm still playing some Super Bowls. You know, I've, I've won a few Super Bowls since rookie premieres came out, so that's been helping me uh, make sure that I, got, I, I had enough coin to get all the rookie premieres. All the rookie premieres but if you guys have not gotten all of them yet okay let's say you let's say you're missing one or two make sure you get them make sure you buy out the packs today and go ahead tomorrow morning buy the packs and for those people that already have completed the rookie premiere players you should take advantage of it because the market right now I believe rookie premiere players are selling at about 53 54 K right now in the auction block so you guys should really take advantage of it too tomorrow if you can if you have the coin for it so it's some great news guys make sure you you go ahead and, and buy those packs tomorrow morning I believe that's the last reset obviously before it expires on the 23rd which I believe is Tuesday I believe that's Tuesday or Wednesday Tuesday I believe so make sure you guys get that done um, let's go ahead and take a quick peek at what the uh, rookie premieres are going for last check I saw them at about 53 54 K so Yep. Wow. 55. Oh my goodness, guys. Wow, that is crazy, guys. They're going for about 55k. Are you kidding me? Wow. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, I mean, I hope you guys did not wait <laughs> to start doing your rookie premieres because if thinking that the prices might get lower, uh that was a bad move because man, the prices really went up. When I completed it, I bought these for like 33, 34, 35k a pop. Now they're at 55k. Let me refresh it one more time. This this can't be true. Wow, 55k. Jeez, guys. Yeah, so hopefully you guys if you guys have the coin for it, you need a couple more, go ahead, you'll get one for free if you buy all those packs tomorrow morning for 500k, which is a great great price cuz right now they're going for over 1 million coins. Wow. Um, also, I have another tip for you guys. Uh, if you guys have a lot of training, if you guys have a lot of training sitting in your in your binder, um, maybe you completed all the rookie premieres and you still have you have all ten of them still as NATs that sell for 52k a pop. I mean, you're looking at over five five hundred thousand in training, like five hundred twenty thousand in training if you have all the rookie premieres. So another quick tip for you guys. If you're trying to get these done at the last minute, it's fine. Hey, some of us procrastinate. Some of us go, hey, yeah, you know what? 
I'm going to go ahead and complete it right away. I can't wait to complete it. So they complete it the first day it's out or the second day it's out. They got it done a couple of weeks ago. Maybe you're not that person. Maybe you're that person that says, you know what? I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to stock up all my coins. I'm going to wait for a little bit. Maybe the prices go down on those rookie premier players. Uh, maybe I'm just going to wait for a little bit. I, I just didn't feel like playing a couple weeks ago. I just got back into the game. You know, whatever it might be, there is another golden tool that you guys can use to get yourself a rookie premiere. So once you guys go into your archives, go into the seasonal, the seasonal programs, and if you go into Zero Chill, you go to your Ghost of Madden sets. If you guys have a lot of training, and you're still playing the game, maybe you still play Super Bowls, maybe you still play some Mutt Draft, and you have trophies that you guys have stocked up, you haven't used or sold yet, go into this set, complete these, the Ghost of Madden Forever players. These are the power-ups for Mike Vick. Uh, you get Mike Vick, uh, I believe it's Tony Gonzalez, and Champ Bailey. What you're going to be able to do, I'll, I'll show you here right now, you put it, you get trophies, right? You know, you play a season, you play a draft, you get a bunch of trophies, great. It takes only three trophies to make one of these players. So I'm going to go ahead and make, let's make a Mike Vick real quick. Because I want to show you guys a perfect example of what I'm talking about here. All right, you're going to get the fantasy pack. You can pick whichever player you want. It doesn't have to be Mike Vick. It can be it can be Tony Gonzalez if you want. It could be Champ Bailey. It doesn't matter. You pick whoever you want. So for this, I'll just pick Tony Gonzalez. It doesn't matter. All right, you pick him. And if you have the training, all right, it costs about, I want to say about nine, probably about 9,000 training, I believe. Anywhere from about eight to nine thousand training, yeah, because that's sixty-eight. Yeah, you're looking at about sixty-eight, seventy-nine, eight. Yeah, you're looking at about let's say nine k in training. Right, what I want you guys to do is train these guys up. All right, you use the three trophies. You get the power up Ghost of Madden Forever card. You train each of these guys up to a ninety-four. Do not go past ninety-four. Go straight to ninety-four and go no further. All right. Because what you're going to do is, each of these guys that you that you create up to a 94, you're then going to be able to take that card and put it into the exchange set to get 95 overall players. Now, why is that great? Well, for one, if you do two of these, okay, you do two of these cards, all right, you win seven, seven games in, in a season, you're going to be able to easily do two of these cards. Depending on what division you're in. I believe it gives you eight trophies, maybe nine in all Madden, or whatever division you're in. You get eight or nine trophies. Go ahead and get two of these, right? You power both of them up to a 94, okay? Power them both up to a 94. And then what you're going to do is you're going to add these two sets at 94 into the 95 exchange, okay? So why does that make sense? Well, not only are you getting... For six trophies and about 18k in training, you're making a card that's guaranteed to be at least valued at about 45k in gold. All right, so you're getting, you're gonna create a card from those two power-ups that goes for at least the lowest I've seen is about 45k. If you're on PS4, all right, if you're on PS4, 45k is about the lowest I've seen. All right, so you want to do this set right here. Alright, this is the 94 and 95 power-up exchange. The great thing about doing this is that, and I've already pulled one so far, the NFL 2019 draft players, okay, the draft night players, the, the, the most current draft, you know, the, the ones with uh, DeAndre Baker, um, uh, Daniel Jones, Kyler Murray, those draft cards actually sell... Well, not sell, but they, they actually go into the set of the Rookie Premier exchange set. So if you're lucky enough, you're going to pull a 95. It's going to be worth at least 45K, all right, which is good value. If you have a bunch of training, which a lot of us do, all right, you're going to get at least 45K for just those two cards. But what makes it really special is that if you go ahead and you go into the Rookie Premier set, 
and you'll see where if you exchange it, just a 95, a 95 to a 97 will give you two rookie premier tokens. All right, what does that mean? What's that value? That's valued at about 200 plus K right now. All right, those are valued at about 200K or more in coins. But we're not worried about that. We're not concerned about the coins. We don't care about the coins. We're trying to get rookie premieres. You're going to get two rookie premier tokens, okay? That's going to help you significantly finish off your last rookie premier, or maybe you want to do an extra rookie premier on another account or whatever you're, you're doing right now. That's going to help you significantly. So if you're lucky enough, you have a bunch of training, you have some trophies, create those two cards, power them up to a 94, put them into the 94 and 95 exchange set, pull at least a card valued at 45K, which is almost enough to get you one rookie premier card as it is. But if you're lucky enough and you do it a few times, you should pull at least one of these 95 and 97 draft players and they're gonna give you, and that's just a 95 to 97, okay? Uh, if you do some other sets, there's some other trophy sets from the draft night that you can do the 98s, and maybe you get lucky and do it for like 60 trophies, great. But I think for the value, you know, using six trophies and a bunch of training, and you can just, you know, get two rookie premier tokens, that's a great value. I, I mean, trophies sell at, what, 1,500 coins a pop? You know? Um, if if for some reason you're not worried or you're not concerned about rookie premiere and you're just trying to make coins, well, that's a great way to make coins anyway. You know, because you can go ahead and you can sell those draft players for 200k a pop. You know, um, or if you really if you don't have the training but you have a lot of trophies, you can still go ahead and sell those Ghosts of Madden Forever power ups for about I say about 12k right now. Let's see how much they're going for. I believe they're going for about 12k. They're going for about 12k right now it, it, on the PS4. 12, 12 and a half k So, if you don't have the training, they're still worth it, you know? You can get two of these guys, you know, for six trophies, and it's worth, like, 25k. So, either way, either way you guys want to do it, and any way you, get, you guys want to exploit that, go ahead. It's a, great, it's a great way to transform your training into coins or into rookie premieres. Um, I know a lot of guys right now are just scrambling to finish their rookie premieres, and you know I feel kind of bad for you guys because the prices right now are crazy. 55k, 56k, that that's that's pretty obscene. But with that great news tomorrow, we're getting the reset on those packs. Make sure you guys get up bright and early, do those resets as much as you can. Um, I will definitely be doing it. I will probably be selling off the rest of my team. I could probably raise at least 500, 600k from the rest of my team. So I'll go ahead and complete those packs myself tomorrow. Um, you really have no excuse not to unless you just don't have the coins. Maybe you already moved on. You're just waiting for Madden 20. You're already set. You're already sitting pretty with all the rookie premieres. Hey, more power to you. But this is to help everybody else out there that does not have maybe a lot of coin. Maybe they have a lot of training. They have some trophies, but they just don't have a lot of coin. Go ahead. Do the Ghost of Madden Forever sets. You can make some rookie premier tokens that way. Uh, for everybody else, tomorrow morning, these sets re uh, uh, reset tomorrow. I believe they're going to reset at 20 packs again. So you're just going to be able to do at least one more rookie premier from just buying these packs tomorrow for 500k. I believe it's going to be 20. You know, they didn't say that there's going to be a, li a limit necessarily, but if they're just going to reset it, you know, common sense would just say it's going to be 20 more packs. So. All right, guys, that's enough for today. Um, I will go ahead and create another video probably tomorrow showing you what I did, what my status is, because I'm also on the hunt of trying to make some more Rookie Premier tokens um, for a couple of other accounts that I'm working on. So we'll see what happens. But until then, guys, peace out and have a good night.